Good morning, everybody. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Happy Saturday. Hey, what's up, Charles? What is going on? How's everyone feeling this morning? Feeling good. Hey, I'm good. Right. Nice. We got a special guest today, Mr. Chris Dahl. Good morning. Welcome in. Thank you. Thank you for having me. Chris, it's uh, it's your the guest star today. So what what do you want to talk about? Yeah, that's a tough one. Um, I, I, I'd say Netflix. What's everyone watching on Netflix right now? Netflix. Okay, right, we we right. did talk about a lot this morning, but Netflix was one of them. Right. So, Charles, what are you watching? Well, what's your what's your what's your girlfriend watching? <laughs> right. So right now she's watching Abbott Elementary. It's this like comedy special. It's like based in a elementary school, obviously, but yeah, it's pretty funny, and that's what she's watching currently. But you know, I tag along and <laughs> see what's going on with the show. Do you do that a lot, or do you have your own show? I don't have my own show because yeah. I don't really watch nothing. But uh, Abbott Elementary has been keeping last in the house. So, nice. <laughs> what about you guys? Chris, what are you watching? I I have watched Abbott Elementary. I'll say it is a good show. Yeah. Okay. Um, nice. Let's see. I've been watching. I watched Love Is Blind season two. If you guys haven't watched that yet, it's actually really good. Love is blind. Yeah. Oh yeah, there was a couple of people at work talking about that yeah, it's too. It's kind of interesting. These people, they like meet behind a wall and they find like their future oh. soulmate. It's kind of interesting to see how that works out. Really. And then uh, I watched the Kanye documentary Genius. That was really interesting. We were talking about that at the at the coffee shop. That's yes. that's a cool documentary. That someone is so bold that he'd film himself before he was yeah. famous. Yeah. And that's, that's a gamble. Like, it, it was. It was like, what if he didn't make it? Like, he's gonna just have tape of himself. It's great, like home movies. It, yeah. was, it, was, it was. pretty what interesting. I watched that uh, this week too. What else, <laughs> Bryce? What are you watching, man? Um, I've been watching the uh, Kanye documentary. Um, I've also been watching some of Power uh, and then oh, Euphoria. Nice. Of course, I've been watching, but it is all over now. So. Um, I need some new shows to watch. Is it so? Power's not on Netflix, right? Oh no! What's that see, on? No, but see, but isn't that curious? Isn't that weird oh. that like Chris says Netflix and everyone just uh-huh. like Netflix is really TV now? Yeah. Is it, it's kind of like you sub it for True. TV. I think the only thing then I watch on Netflix is probably uh, yeah the Kanye documentary and uh, NCIS. Yeah, mm-hmm. NCIS. Like yeah. It's intimidating because there's so many streaming platforms out now that like yeah, you know, yeah. Netflix, Hulu, Peacock. Um, I know there's Disney Plus. There's more than that. It's almost to a point where like I get frustrated. Which one do I even want to go on? I watched mm-hmm. all of those this week, Chris. Yeah. Peacock, mostly Peacock this week. But, but Netflix, I watched Kanye's documentary because everyone kept talking about it. I'm only on part of episode two. But um, I've been watching a lot. So um, I'm embarrassed to say my wife is watching The Real Housewives of Beverly Hills. <laughs> and I am like... You can't. You cannot look away. It's like a train wreck. You have to watch it. <laughs> so I've been watching that. Um, I, I did get all of eighteen eighty three in and um, mm-hmm. Yellowstone, which was awesome. Yeah, oh, man, it's really good. I hate westerns, but that was good. Mm-hmm. Um, I, don't know, I feel like I watched something else too. Oh, I've been watching Pawn Stars over oh, and over nice. again too. Yeah. Again, I'm in streaming Vegas that. Vegas locals. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So um, there's a lot on, but. If you have any suggestions of what to watch, put it down because we're looking to put it down in the comments because we're looking for something to watch after everything we've been watching. And just to touch bases on like all those streaming platforms, I don't know about you guys, but when I watch like Hulu, yeah. like I can't deal with the commercials. Like, oh, I love commercials. Ads, oh my gosh, I cannot no. deal with it. I've been programmed just to watch it straight. Yeah. Uh, so yeah, I, I just can't deal with it. I feel like commercials bring me like, it makes, it brings me back into reality. Like, and it does, uh, yeah. It gives, yeah, you, a break. Okay. It gives yeah. you a break, yeah. Ooh, I can breathe. Yeah. Yeah. And or not even that, like it takes you outside of the world that you're in mm-hmm. and back into the normal world, like, oh yeah, yeah, like I I know that product or I know like I don't know. Makes me feel good like I'm watching old TV again. Yeah. Mm, yeah. I see. But mm-hmm. that's that. So we've got a a windy day ahead of us, mm-hmm. uh, a little chilly. Mm-hmm. Uh, what are we driving today, Charles? You picked this car. A Toyota Tacoma twenty twenty one, I believe. Yeah, it has below eight thousand miles. Oh wow. Um, yeah, you know, it's pretty hard to find Tacomas out there now, so we definitely do have one. Extremely low miles. I, I feel like, like we always have, I feel like we always have one. We always seem to have one Tacoma yeah. around. Mm. So Lex Las Vegas is the place to, to find a Tacoma now too. <laughs> so come on down. Awesome. Yes. Awesome, awesome. Christian, any last words for us today? 
You know, I don't, but I'm just grateful to be here. It's a perfect weather day. You know, yeah. a lot of places aren't this sunny today, so we're very fortunate here in Las Vegas. Definitely. Oh, cool. So let's have a great day. Come see the Tacoma. Come see us. We'll see you at the dealership, everyone. Bye. See you soon. Bye.